Good day, lords and ladies, welcome back to Griftlands. We call it nice, and we played it for release. Now, in the last episode, we got messed up really badly, and um, I need to heal. So, oh man, but that's but that's really important. That's just an artifact. This is opportunity with spear. Let's try for it. If we can get an auto dog. Greetings, welcome to my humble shop. What kind of wares do you have? I've got the best deals on auto dogs in all the bog. My collection varies from pristine auto dogs straight from the factory to modified versions with direct feral ones. Of course, they're all loyal and obedient. Trained, trained feral one myself. Okay, so. Let's try buy let's buy the Spark Baron Auto Dog. Because it's it's probably the best one out of the bunch. I take you the best you've got. Excellent choice. Definitely the most value for your money. So we got Yeah, we got this. No, that's where is it? Normally they sort it up here. Yeah. So he we if we can keep the dog alive, it would be a great use to us. But now we do need to go back and get healed. A lot. Um, yeah. Right, we get a meal. Cost us 30 sil. Get bloated added to our combat deck. That's not great. Okay. So we're healed up just over halfway. We've got a bit of money left. Is there any cards that I want to pull out of my deck? Um, we got this Parasite card. We can't do anything with. Uh, so annoying. Um, that's okay. Right. I wish we, we may need to get another combat card if we're being honest. Let's see if there's anything we can pick up in the comp uh, an event. A stranger approaches you foolish of them given your track record so far. Hail soldier, it seems like you're the type who needs to spend their me metal. Metil. I wasn't aware of that. I had a name. Humanity looks good on you. Humility looks good on you, but we both know it's only skin deep. Ask about Metil. I heard of this, a sort of heads religion, yes? It's more than quite quaint, persistent friend. Metel Metel is the force to be reckoned with. Greed Great deeds and great purpose draw Mattels to you, Mattel to you, and some will trade handsomely for it once gathered. I see fortune favours the bold, as they say. Here, find the stride and see for yourself. Plun Plundell pulls out a map and points to a location that seems just a, just a, seems just a cave. And take this to get you started, you'll soon see what I mean. Gain five Mattel. Okay. So, Mattel vendor, you have five Mattel to spend on upgrades and two prestige points to spend on flourishes. Oh, it's like, is this a, is this a like a prestige thing if we keep going? You again? What kind of scam are you running here, friend? No scam, I swear. I just here to help you be your best. With the power of Mattel. Purchase five metal, which would take a lot of sell. I'm not flourishes. Oh, this is to do with our, um, sort of our special ability to charge up during combat. How about we unlock flourishes? I want to learn some new things. You have two available prestige points, a said between Cell, Rook, and Smith. You will be able to play any of the unlocked flourishes during battle or negations by filling your flourish bar for each. Earn more prestige points when defeating each boss and each prestige level. Um, check your boss compendium to track your progress per boss. Okay. So. Ariant unlocks, defeat Ariat, meet Ariat, receive Boon, receive Bane, Crimson Drusk, defeat the Crimson Drusk, meet the Crimson Drusk. Oh, so, because these are the bosses that we meet, and if we fight or um, do stuff with them, see here, we get a Flourish point to take it. Defeat Nandan. Um, defeat Handbell, meet Handbell, receive Boon, receive Bane. Okay. 
there's some still some we haven't man there's a lot we haven't met yet okay met the frog defeat the frog I thought I'd beaten this already with one of my other characters okay Seal has... okay. So I take it we spend metal um, to unlock bonuses. Basic card, battle card, start bonus XP, okay. So, two available press each one available to said between Rock, Sal, Sal, Rock and Smith, okay. So I take it we only get prestige points once we, we clear one of their... Um, points but the thing is I haven't unlocked any of them fully so how do we have two is it because I've maybe they accumulate over time I have no idea okay so defeating each boss in each of their prestige level so in each prestige level okay so we need to get another five presses to unlock the next basic flourish. All right. Spend metal. Okay, so five available metal points that Rook has earned are available only to himself. Use it to make Rook progress more skilled. You can earn more metal by completing certain quests, killing specific targets, defeating particular, defeating particular arguments. Oh, okay, that's fine. So we can increase the maximum health. By two, increase your maximum resolve by one. Start the game with additional sills. Basic cards start with bonus XP. So this is just making it so that future runs are quicker. I take it. Yeah. Restore additional health when eating. Um. The bottom five aren't really worth it. Increase your max health by two. It's not great. None of these look particularly great. Um, that one looks okay. Recovering health after after, after every negotiation would be good. Okay. Now ask about metal. So what's this metal anyway? It's a mess of how much you appeal applied yourself in this life and in the previous ones what do you mean previous ones ha you don't know do you well i'm going i'm not going to spoil it for you grifter maybe you should f someday figure it out how to get metal how do i get metal metal will find you if you are worthy if you see an opportunity seize it hmm can i just buy it from you of course I'll ask about flourishes what are flourishes it's an advanced technique only usable under certain conditions. You can't learn them in the usual way, but you never forget them once you know them. Odd. Indeed. Right. See, this is a mechanic I am not familiar with. Right, let's see. We've got a vendor. Let's see if there's any cards. Spend one chance, deal bonus damage per empty shell cell. Target all enemies, gain two defense per target. That actually be useful against multiple enemies. And in negotiations, apply free composer prepared prepared one sorry. Apply free composer prepared if prepared, apply one composer to all friendly arguments. Okay. Venture, spend up to two influence, rig free snail heads for each hundred spent yeah okay and gain at the start of your turn choose a card in your hand prepare it that's nice but i have no way enough money um i do want i want another i would like this one to be honest because target all enemies gain two defense per target the more enemies we get the more defense we get which is really nice okay let's get that And 
and then we're gonna have to go down here. Hopefully we're gonna have enough help to deal with anything we can run into. You arrive at the drop point this time at ambush. You quick you you jolt quickly in a bird scratch. Only you and a few others understand detailing what you've learnt of the rise in the Spark Barons. You file your report and find a message left for you by your by a counterpart on the other side of the wall. Um, opportunity bandit babysitter. Pick a uh, pick a graft from a random drawer. 155 seals, two metal. Get two metal for rook. That'd be useful. The pin instructions read: document documents are embarrassing to the cult. Hess have been stolen and currently in the possession of an exiled spree raiding party operating the bog. Make contact with Lillibull, a cult priest in the region, and coordinate to recover the documents. Okay. This is going to be fun. So I take it we're working for the code. I'm low on health. I am going to have to... If it's going to be combat... Yeah, I'm getting a lot of bloated cards. I don't like it. But I need to be at good health for this if it's a fight combination. Lyra... Um, Lulabil is rumoured to have a voice as sweet as Clover, but the Hessian chants reduce it to watery gurgle. Um, simply spread the word of Hess through the lib uh, Liberty Comrade as swallow, swill, swill hole joint. Sorry, simply spreading the word of Hess through Libasis Comradery of the, of the swill hole. Join me. I could if I had money. Gain cards, tips, insert, restore ten resolve. I wish I could, but I um, ask about the job. Your hair shirt. Your little bull. I'm Rook. I'm. I've paid for help. You've paid for help. You. I was hoping for someone a little more pious. I could let you work things out with Hess personally if you prefer. No, no. Hess tentacles writhe in mysterious ways. Perhaps you are a ripple left by his passing. That's a good thing. Ask for details. So these documents. The spree have the documents. They stole them and now they're hiding out in the bog waiting for things to blow over. A loosely organization collection of bandits, crime rings and illegal debt brokers. And now you want me to walk in their guns blazing and get them back? Don't you people have a luminary, a luminary for this kind of thing, the coat of Hesse's specialist and well-trained forces. No, I need to keep quiet. Using the, the Illuminary would invite questions that I don't want answered. What I want you to do is distract the spree leader, offer him a score that he can't refuse and take them out of the encampment. And I'll sneak in and get the documents while you're out. Then we can meet back up for payment. What's what scores do they offer? I am an honest grifter, not some bandit. I've arranged something. A merchant caravan has broken down on one of the bog's back roads. Their car will get the spree's attention. Ask about the caravan. Just happen to know a caravan was broken down nearby. That's suspiciously convenient timing. The Hess provides with proper appease, when properly appeased. And I have to say, his tithe money. I may have to use his tithe money to arrange some light sabotage. Ask about the documents. So what are these documents? The contents are embarrassing both to the cult generally and to me specifically. But I'm paying for you to help, not questions. Head out to the bog. To the bog it is then. Yes. Go convince them of the score. I will follow at a distance. If the spree see us together, the plan won't work. Okay. Here's the mission. I'm absolutely broke, so we're going to have to fight this. Or negotiate her way. You find the bandits where Lulabil said that it would be. The leader, Duno, hears your approach. Who's there? It's just a simple grifter, I mean you no harm. How did you even find this place? I heard some big players from Murder Bay were in the bog. My speciality lies in finding things that other people don't know about, and I'm good at my job. Which is why I sought you out, I have a proposition. We're big players, you, you have that part right. Well, spill it out. Well, spit it out then. But I don't, if I don't like what I hear, I have to kill you where you stand. Attack the entire bandit camp. Yeah, no. Convince Duno you have a lead on a big score. There's a merchant caravan nearby, transporting bog goods to the gate. It's slightly defended and it's stuck. We could take it out if we work together. 
Okay, by the book, cannot target core arguments. Okay. We've got a bit of armor, but he's smashing into us hard. Choose two cards to discard. Um, let's get those two out of the way. Okay. We need to get some composure up so we don't take any damage. And then we hit him for 10 points of damage. So now we're in advanced. Ooh. Negotiation flourish. Fill up the flourish bar. Trigger one of Rook's flourishes. Flourishes persist between negotiations. Okay. Do we want to pay one of these to end this quickly? Yeah, let's go for it. Okay, so we took a bit of damage, not a ton. Got to flip back. Apply some composure. Draw two cards, gamble for each hostile card drawn. Let's go there. Um, buy the book. Uh, let's go snails. Ton of damage, and then we'll hit him. Not target core arguments expanded. Okay, fine. Uh, let's keep that in our hand for a bit. Yes, fine. Okay, what's this? Stack. When a hostile card is played, increase stack by one and gain two resolve. Add two, one damage to all in ten. Okay, so we need to kill that right now. Because um, whenever we play a hostile card is played, increase stacks by one and gain two resolve. Plus one damage to all in ten. Like, so this is really bad for us. So that needs to go right now. Um, gain at the end of your turn of reply. Let's play this. Armor up. And we gain some influence. Uh, we'll gain additional armor. Oh, he's got the Parasite out. Oh, he got the Parasite out. When this card is drawn, increase the cost of a random card. Yeah, that's really bad for us. Um, well, let's first gain some influence. Let's get some... Ah, oh, he put armor on that. That's really bad. We can finish this fight right now. Fantastic, before he does any damage to us. Excellent. Choose a negotiating card to add to your hand. Um, none of these are particularly big. Draw two cards, gamble for each hostile card drawn. We've already got one of those. Um, discard. Discard your hand, draw five cards. Do max damage, prepare gain one action. I really don't want to bloat out my deck anymore. I might none of these really grab my fancy. I'm just gonna take Sill. A couple of cards leveled up. Set the coin. Choose a side with the coin and flip it to the side. To that side. That's fine. What's a plenish? When the card is drawn, draw another card. That could actually be pretty useful. And then he's get that's upgraded. So Get more damage or gain more influence. All the diplomacy cards do maximum damage. That's actually really nice, because while that does more damage, gaining more influence is actually pretty nice. Especially since that most of my... Alright, we're yeah, okay. So especially since most of my deck has uh, a fair amount of diplomacy cards in it. Um... Yeah, we earned metal. 
and fantastic. So this is something that's obviously just been added into Griftlands, which is nice to see. Um, so we can unlock stuff for our characters. So it means that if we lose, next time we play, we have more advantages. Do you want some? Your offer sounds good. Almost too good. I like good offers. We hit the caravan and split the loot 80-20 deal. Of course. Lead the way. Me, me and my people will follow behind. You the two to talk and we will step in if we need to. Do no round up his troops and heads out. You play along. Okay. It doesn't tell me how to... Oh, I got six metal. I need to get to ten if I want to get anything decent. Right. Babysitting. You find a caravan. Someone is arguing loudly with a very disgruntled Osnu. Get moving, you useless pile of ooze. Wait, did you hear that? Who's there? Oh, a grift. What do you want? Threaten the caravan. She would just like her so we can just straight up start attacking people. But then she would... Now let's just threaten her. It's not much what I want as to what you want. As in, do you want to live? You're surrounded by bandits, friend. As a personal favour, I'm giving you one chance to walk away unscathed before my associates pop up, pop out of the book and cut you down. Okay. Buy the book. Right, she's got to do a ton of damage right off the bat. Um... I need to compose or I need to damage. We'll throw that out. We can't play that. So let's choose around the card. All right, we get that. Um, put composure on me to basically armor up. Then we will go. Okay, so we're now just around the same health. Ooh, okay, she's bribing us. Pay five sil. Uh, money talks. At the start of each turn, a random card at the hand costs an additional ten sil with this with this negotiation. That really sucks. Um, she's hitting us. A kickback. Um, that's prepared. Let's gamble. I need to kill that argument straight out. It hurts me to use my, my most powerful card for that, but I can't afford to keep taking hits like that. She's going to hit us anyway, which hurts. Um, yeah, I still got cards I can play, but I can't afford to take. Yeah, this hurts. When destroyed, Rick gains one next to a card at the start of his turn. Um, Show up, let's cover our health up. I will have to pay this, just... We pay a bit of money, but do the damage to her, and then we'll play some Composer. Right. No deal, pay 15 silver. at the end of your turn with this card, take... Yeah, that's... Man, this hurts. Um... But I need to just... Keep smashing people with cards. Man, that's gonna hurt. Let's see if we can compare, compare something. Yeah. Didn't work, but we got something out of it. Not great, but a little bit. Ouch. Right, we need to end this fight quickly. My resolve is running out. Okay. 
Right, here we go. Can't pay any of these sale coins. Um, we can play something for free with one less action. Okay, let's play that. Then we'll play this. We'll prepare that and finish some more. Man, that was close. We took a ton of damage. Um, set the coin. No, just money. Nice what we're having. Take it, take it all. The job isn't worth dying for. Onawa and her entourage scurry off and Duno comes out of hiding. You appear to have a way of words, Grifter. Now let's see what we've got here. Duno spends a long time rustling through the various packs and creates attacks to the Yusno. He's happy with his finds. We went kidding about this haul. We'll be eating the good part We'll be eating the good part of the Usna once with fence this stuff. Uno fumbles around with a coin purse. Yeah, no. Take the 50 fee. Thank you, Duno. I'm glad this worked out to a mutual benefit. I clean up here, be seeing you. You wonder how happy Duno would be when you realize what actually happened here. Yeah, he's not going to be happy. Help the Acolyte, yeah. My resolve is shot. I could go back and pay some alcohol to get it back up. That might be worth it. Yeah, buy a drink. Right. That's not great. We're done. We've got seven. I still need some more to actually get anything half decent. You find a little by waiting for you. Did you get the documents? I did, thank you. I hope Duno wasn't too much trouble. Tell Lubai what happened. I successfully occupied Duno. Duno has no idea what's happening to the... Duno arrives and charges forward with a fresh untried to follow us. You lying, thieving, no account, cheat. He hates us. You incurred his fury and will likely face consequences. Brutal status cards cost one additional action. Yep, that's gonna be... Defend yourself. This is going to suck. Keep your me alive, Grifter. I can't pay you if I'm dead. Right. First things first. Um, let's get some armor up. Because he is punching us hard. And I need to get these bugs off my back. Ouch. Yeah, he's pinned. He's put a pin card in my deck. Right, okay. I need to basically burn down. He keeps just pounding us with attacks. Okay. Um, everybody's just pounding us, isn't it? That's just how it is. Okay. Let's go. We're going to absorb some of the damage. Um, so who's going after this? Okay, so they're both hitting her, are they? I mean, if we take this out, this would do a good amount of damage. Hopefully enough to blow it up. No, it did not. Another pin card. Not great. Okay. Yeah, they're just loving me, aren't they? Okay, this needs to die. That's dying this turn. Um, and I need to basically get rid of this thing's armor. Right, the 
bug's gone. Yeah, we're getting bleed all over the place. Okay. Let's play this card. We'll then do... some composer to absorb damage. They're out of it for another couple of rounds. He's really punching me. Okay. Let's get some defense up to mitigate damage. A bit of damage anyway. That's all I can do. Right, let's we just gotta add the bunker down. Right, so if I kill her. Um, makes if dagger. If I, he's my rival, so I need to kill him. Cause he hates me. Yeah. Okay, we'll kill him, and we'll accept the surrender of her. Right. So we gain a battle card. Man, these are not what I wanted. Defense is nice. I'll just get I'll get that and have to cut a card out of my deck. Earn metal. Earn bonus metal, because we killed someone to take it. Couple of loot cards. Um some money stolen from us, and we get some result back. You you start to get a reputation for violence. At the end of your turn, accept two apprentices and destroy this card. Unplayable. Apply two composer to a random argument. Okay. Good work, Grifter. At least I, could, I don't have to worry about this coming back to me. She loves us. Bio feedback. Status cards cost one less actions in battle. Very nice. Get paid. Okay. Gain two metal. Pick a grift as a reward. Oh, all combat types, okay. At the start of each turn, apply two mark, actually. That's actually pretty nice. At the um, Gain two power at the start of each battle, lose two power at the first time you take any damage. Twin sword at the start of each battle, gain two charges. This is the plot each turn. Mark, when you attack this target, gain one charge and reduce mark by one. That's actually pretty powerful. Because it means we can stack charge quicker so we don't have to use um, as many of our defensive cards. Okay, so that's all done. We've got 14 metal. Random events. A lone figure loitering inside the road. Hey pal, you got sealed spare for an out of work labourer. Okay, we can give him to love us. What does he give us for loving him? Uh, gift 50 sil. Here you go. Clean yourself up. Well, really? You're alright, you know that? You ever need anything, just ask. So he got us to love him, and we got the voice of the people. Start on negotiations with the voice of people argument. Target an opponent argument each turn for 2-2 two, two damage. This argument for solve damage doubles for each stack. That's actually pretty powerful. If you need anything, just ask. Okay, so let's go and do this. We're having the most intense days of the right now. Do we know each other? Sometimes. Sometimes not. 
Depends on how you how far you get each time. Each time I what? Probably don't want to know the details. Right, okay. Um What do we want? Battle cards start with bonus XP, negotiation cards bonus XP. The recovering resolve after every battle is nice. Recovering health after every negotiation is really nice as well. I'm probably saving up for going for the um, recover health. Virus gained from mitigating damage in the ghost system increased. Or actually, just going. Pets are really powerful in this game, so if we can increase the pet's health, that would be good. Sophia Mia. See your shop. Yeah, we still can't unlock anything yet. Okay, let's go back to the pub. Erinit emerges from the back of the bar. Rifter, we have reason to speak. Always, we're willing to talk to friend or to you even. I have researched your past, I have researched your connections. I have seen reports of what you do when you are not working for Felomo. Your charms may work on him, but I'm far more diligent than my employer. Hear out Arid's demands. Right, so you've done your homework. What do you want from me? Do you know why the barons are in the bog? I always assumed you got your kicks watching poor folks work at digging, at digging holes. No. The work is the point, not the workers. We would be more than profitable with fewer mouths to pay and fewer rebellious bonuses to break. Rebel, rebellious bones to break, naturally. To the end, we have been testing a machine for automated digging. But, but there's always a but, isn't there? But it has malfunctioned and is destroying valuable company assets. I need you to commission the machine by force. Ask about the machine. Tell me about this machine. How big is it? It's an automatic that we recovered from the bog, probably a battle unit, judging by its design. You found an ancient battle mech and you decided to use it to dig holes. Creating holes in the ground is not that different from creating holes in an opponent. In some ways, it's even easier. The ground rarely presents a moving target. Ask about the damage. You said this machine was damaging company assets. Which assets? It's terminated a full sift that was working at the site. Eight laborers and a foreman. Even worse, it damaged their equipment. It will cost hundreds of seal to replace. Ask why your help is needed. You barons have a lot more firepower than I do. Why are you spending me, sending me to do this? I could send a patrol to decommission the machine, but they would be casualties and casualties mean paperwork. And I hate paperwork. I will have spent enough time talking to you. You will go perform the task now. Ariant leaves the building. Okay, that ain't that is not good news for us. Um, how's our health looking? The dog's looking a bit beaten up. Maybe we could hire someone. This is gonna be rough. We can't do it right now. I've been Cornish Knight. This has been Grifflands. We will see if we can beat the battle mech. I thought that I thought the thing we did down here was the boss monster. But obviously, it's not. This is the boss monster. Well, this is gonna suck. I'll see you all next time. Goodbye, folks.